My name is Charlene Horn, and I'm the video editing supervisor at CBS3 in Philadelphia. For the past 36 years, Charlene Horn has walked the halls of CBS3, first as an intern for Evening Magazine, then as a production assistant for People Are Talking. Live from the studios of Channel 3. What a show we've got for you today. It was a very difficult time in the beginning because broadcasting has been a man's world, was a man's world at that time. And so when I came down, the mantra was, keep the broads out of broadcasting. But that didn't stop this Penn State grad who scored a job at news right out of college and put her nose to the grindstone, earning respect. I just kept coming and doing what I needed to do. Today, she manages 10 editors, schedules live shots, edits, and conducts quality control for every piece of video that hits the air all while making her impact felt both behind and in front of the camera. I make it a point to make sure I know what's going on in the news and I make it a point to uh, make sure I am feeding stories to the assignment desk, some positive stories that are going on in the community so we're not just seeing, you know, having a negative impact on, uh, you know, what's going on in our black community. So I'm constantly trying to balance that, give them positive stories. Here's great things happening. Let's. Uh, Let's look at this, let's cover that, you know, and it's a fight. It's just in her nature. She is the, she has that personality that is a strong will, strongly driven to do what's right for one and for all. And she never bears uh, away from that. She stays confident. She stays uh, in, in the world of fairness and equity for everyone. What words would I use to describe Charlene? Well, she's compassionate, she's fair, she's smart, she's witty, she's honest. She's just really wonderful. But I have a whole host of adjectives that I could use to describe Charlene. Let's start with the A's, can we? Able, adaptable, assertive, attentive. And she's just terrific, the list goes on and on. One word that comes up time and time again when talking about Charlene is mentor. She does things very quietly. You would never know, but I know because I watch her, I can watch her from a distance. What's interesting is that she'll mentor whether you're young or whether you're in the middle of your career or whether you're like us. Oh yeah. Because and she'll like say. <laughs> okay, I know what you're saying. Yeah, you know, yeah, because what she'll do is she'll look at something that we've done and right. she'll say, you know, I think there's a way to be able to do this better. She's been a counselor since the minute I arrived at CBS3. And we've shared many, many conversations about our industry, about our work life, about being women who grew up in this business at a time when maybe women weren't really at the top of the heap. There are thousands of people across the country that have been touched by her through her mentorship, through her expertise, just guidance, phone calls. I mean, she's kind of like a mother figure to many people, whether they are black, white, Asian, Hispanic, she sees the future coming into our newsroom and wants to make sure the future is bright for them as well. While promoting excellence in all that she impacts, this Emmy award-winning video journalist makes diversity a top priority. I think she's done a tremendous job of always being cognizant of you know, creating a diversity in this setting. I mean, it's most important as people in news, as African Americans in news, to be represented and to represent our community. And no one does that better than Charlene. I am the only black female video editor in the station. So she was very integral in that because she fought for me to stay here and keep my job sometimes when you know, that was, the, the, the powers that be had another plan in mind. I think it's important that we have diversity so because it's the, the stories that we cover, it's the way we cover the stories that we cover, and it's how we show the viewers what's important. Although her face is not seen on air, her voice and vision are heard and seen in the people and programs she's influenced. And that's why Charlene Horn, a mother, daughter, friend, and mentor is PABJ's 2014 Impact Award honoree.